Step five, ground spinning. This exercise is really good for your balance. It keeps you in a very central position over your board. It's also very good for your switch writing. And the idea here is that we're trying to build your edging skills so that in all the future buttering tricks we learn, you're always going to be on the correct edge. On a gentle slope, slide a slow backside 180, then continue that around in the same direction, sliding a switch frontside 180. Pay attention to which edge you are using. On the first 180, you're using your toe edge. Then you have to transition onto your heel edge for the second 180. Try to spin a full 360 and see if you can have smooth edging throughout the 360. If you find that your edge tries to catch in the snow, it usually means you have to get on your edge a little bit sooner while sliding that 360. This time slide a slow front 180 and continue it around in the same direction with a switch back 180. Heel edge first, transitioning to toe edge. Try to get a full 360 with clean edging. Ultimately, you want to be able to spin three full rotations with clean, smooth edging and relative speed. Don't do more than three, you'll get a little bit dizzy. Unwind and do another three in the opposite direction. With this exercise, we're building your edge control skills. It's always your uphill edge in contact with the snow. The more you do this, the better you're going to be able to transition this into all buttering tricks and always be on the correct edge. This tutorial is filmed at Whistler Blackcomb. I'm Nev Lapwood from Snowboard Addiction. Our goal is to improve your writing.